Is it too late to succeed on YouTube? I'm gonna talk about that in this video as well as share some details about an upcoming YouTube workshop coming up. Hey, what's up guys? Sean here with Think Media TV. Help you go further, faster in media. And on this channel, we do tech gear and video gear reviews as well as tips and strategy videos just like this one. So if you're new here, consider subscribing. So recently, I've been traveling a lot. I've been in kind of a whirlwind and I've been noticing kind of a trend of what some people are saying as well as some bad information. And here's what I mean. A few months ago, I was able to speak at VidCon on the topic of how to go full-time with a small audience. And so then I got to connect with a ton of YouTubers, video creative uh, creators, you know, uh, creative entrepreneurs, and people after the session. And then a few uh, months later, I spoke at Marketing Impact Academy with Shalene Johnson, an online marketing event. And again, talked to a lot of fitness professionals, network marketers, people doing online marketing and video. And then recently, you may have heard that Video Influencers, a project that I'm working on with Benji Travis, got featured in Forbes. Like, that was crazy. We were super stunned by that. And of course, there were social media and comments that we were engaging with. And I bring all that up to mention again a thread of a trend that I kind of hear from people and that is that it's too late to succeed on YouTube. That it's too crowded, right? And maybe you've heard that and maybe you've thought that. And the reality is I just think that's not true. And not just because that's my opinion, but because it's backed by data. Here's what I mean. I printed out this article from the Huffington Post on the rising billion of new consumers that will arrive online by the year 2020. And it says this, the most dramatic positive change in our global economy is about to occur between 2016 and 2020. That three to five billion new consumers are gonna be coming online, providing a mega surge to the global economy. So here's what that article tells me. It tells me that it's not too late, in fact, that there may have never been a better time than now to really jump in and catch this wave. And so because of that, I actually wanted to do this upcoming workshop and you can register for free at learnyoutubetoday.com and I'll link it up in the description below. And it's really all about the strategy and tips needed to succeed on YouTube. It's about how to grow your audience and actually double your income because maybe you're passionate about going part-time or making a side income or going full-time on YouTube. It's really the information that I wish I had when I was starting out so I could have gone further faster. And the reason it's so important is I think of it like with this illustration. I recently was in Oceanside, California grabbing coffee with one of my best friends, Jeff Morse, who happens to be a surfer. I'm not a surfer. I've gone surfing with him. I tumble in the waves. I got beat up. <laughs> and I never really stood up on the board, which is the goal, and that's besides the point. But he is like a pro, like he's super, super good. And I know this, that he sits there on his board and he watches the ocean and he watches different waves and trends that are happening. And if it's a small wave, he ignores it. He you know, ignores a lot of the waves. But if he sees a big wave, a big opportunity coming, he turns around and he starts to paddle and then he pops up and he rides the wave. That is what's happening. That's what this article is saying over the next few years. And my passion is to help you take advantage of that, for you to ride that wave so you can make a difference in your family, your legacy, your future, and ultimately that you can build your influence, income, and impact so that you can make a greater difference you know, in your family, just in your finances, in your community, the causes you care about, and to take advantage of like one of the greatest periods in history to ever be alive because of the internet and because of online video. So that's what the workshop's all about. I think, you know, generally this is good news. If you just watch this video, it's good news to keep crushing it and to really do some strategic things over the next couple of years, to really put in some hustle over the next few years. And if you're interested in um, learning some of my best tips as well as some new case studies and some stuff that's working right now behind the scenes in my business and how I've been able to go full-time, then sign up at learnyoutubetoday.com. Link in the description below. It's gonna be a lot of fun. Plus, it's live and there's gonna be live Ask Me Anything Q&A as well. And so I hope that you can make it there. And until next time, stay tuned here on Think Media TV for more videos to help you go further, faster in media. Keep crushing it and we will talk soon. Oh! True story. 
I shot a batch of videos with the autofocus set wrong, not to my face like it is now, but it was focused on the background. They were all ruined. So I deleted that SD card and shot the same batch of videos, but during the next batch, I did not turn the mic on. So they were all ruined. And now I'm in the third batch of reshooting all those videos. I'm so tired.